Hello everyone. My name is Ye Da Chuan, and I am the president of International Life of Delivery Workers. Uh, we respond to a lot of Chinese drivers and delivery workers here. So we started serving Chinese Chinese delivery workers and drivers since last year. And uh, so right now our family have more over 1,200 members. So we are very sad to lose a brother of us named uh, Zhi Wei Yan. He worked very hard since through the past 20 years. And he leave his wife and children behind. His loss makes the legitimate fire delivery workers face every day. Who will we grant into? Will they have a problem with the border, our race, our accent? Will we make it a hope or will we get into an accident? When I speak to another Chinese delivery worker, I heard very a lot of stories. They are very harassed. They have close call with violence and accidents. They will go back a fear of what would happen to their family if they dead when they were when they are walking. Whether we are on our backs or in our cars, delivery workers are not safe. Zhi Wei Yan's death demands immediate, immediate action from app delivery worker company and the city to make our safer. We cannot afford to lose one more. Thank you very much. So right now I'm going to talk in my in Chinese. In, in the past, we have many people who have died or died. Because of the violence or the violence. We are very sad because after they left, they will lose a very important person. They will be sad because they will have a huge amount of money that no one will be able to pay. We don't want to lose any other person. We want to let our voices hear all the people in this society, let the government hear, let the government hear. We want to live a more safe life, a more safe life. 来保障我们的生活，然后我们希望生活能变得更好。谢谢 ，Thank you。